What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to remap the paddles and other controls on your Xbox Series Elite 2 controller, Elite Series 2 controller, um, to any key on your keyboard, uh, because the Microsoft app does not let you do that internally. You can only map the keys to other, I mean, the paddles or buttons to other buttons on the uh, controller itself. So it's not really useful for us PC gamers. And I'm going to show you how to edit that today, uh, or how to change that today. Before we get started, I want to give a quick shout out to uh, Todd M and Leslie Media. Thank you so much for uh, becoming channel supporters. If you want to support this channel, click on that join button below and get access to our live stream archives and um, emoticons and shout outs and videos like this. I also want to give a quick shout out to Javi, Javi. Uh, they sent me some free goodies here, uh, a coffee concentrate that's actually really, really good. I've been using it a lot in my iced coffees lately, and I'm going to have a video on that soon, um, uh, to talk a little bit more about how I use, um, Javi coffee just because, I mean, I mean, they didn't like pay me anything specifically or anything like they sent me this for free. So I'll let you guys know that, but it's not technically like an ad or anything. I just really like it. <laughs> but anyway, um, let's go ahead and jump into the uh, video itself. So what we want to do is we want to use an app called ReWASD. ReWASD. And that is at ReWASD.com. And it works for all of these different controllers here. So it's pretty useful if you have a uh, PS5 controller, PS4 controller, an Xbox controller, a Switch controller, whatever you're using, it can map on here. Um, it does cost $7, uh, also not a sponsor. Kind of annoying, but we can try the 14-day trial to make sure it's what we really want. And then um, if it's doing what we need it to do, then 7 bucks ain't too bad. So let's go ahead and install this and try it out. We're going to click on re WASD and yes and here is the installer looks very nice very professional and it looks like it's going to do what we need it to do so that's nice and we need to restart the PC unfortunately all right, so we've restarted the PC. Let's go ahead and open up REWASD. All right, so we have this here. Let's go ahead and plug in our controller. So the Elite Series 2 is in. It did detect the gamepad, it looks like, on the left. So let's click on that. And the controller vibrated to show that it's uh, selected. That's good. Let's go ahead and add an app for it to uh, play with. Let's call this uh, Cold War. We need box art for it. Oh my goodness. Let's use this box art. All right. So now we have the Cold War setting here, and we can start mapping things. So let's look at the back of the controller, because this is what we really want to map, right? Uh, let's click on one of these. And now we can choose what we want it to do um, whenever we press it. So the right top paddle is going to be a W. And let's hit Apply. And I'm like, what happens when we press this right paddle? WWW. That's a big W for me. Um, it looks like it works very cleanly. Um, I think I might actually buy this too. Um, hashtag not a sponsor, but do they have an affiliate program? Can we get in on this? I don't know. Uh, it looks like a really clean app. It worked perfectly the first time I tried it. Kind of got to love that about software. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below, or if you want me to try other alternatives, maybe I can find some free stuff out there that might work the same way. Uh, thanks for watching and have a great day. Peace. What? You've never heard of stream savers? And you thought PewDiePie was the only YouTuber to make a game? <laughs>
I made a game too, and it's called Stream Savers, and it's available for pre-order right now for $9.99. And that's a great price.